Greetings, I'm back with another unboxing video and today I'll be unboxing the Maverick Mini Bundle. So, a little bit of backstory about me. I'm a designer, right? Uh, I studied architecture, graphic design, construction management. So, by profession, I'm a designer. Even though my official title when working is an art director, hopefully move into production designer soon. So, my unboxings are usually going to be from the standpoint of a designer. You know, I buy tools and gadgets to use as an aid in design. I'm not going to have all the technical specs and totally nerd out about, you know, every little number about these products. So, anyway, this, uh, this Maverick Mini Bundle I bought at Costco. Yo, Real talk, I always tell people like, yo, if you're looking for deals on electronics, Costco is a good spot. I've, I bought so many things at Costco. Uh, I currently don't have a MacBook Pro, but the last MacBook Pro I bought, I, I also bought that at Costco. The last uh, PC laptop I bought, which I'm currently using, uh, i i7 uh, Intel processor, I bought it at Costco. So, I always tell people, looking for deals on electronics and stuff, go to Costco. Well, anyway, I bought this two years ago, fam, and this always happens with me. I buy things, and then they'll sit in the closet or something before I get to use them. Because usually, when I'm working on a project, whether it be a feature film or a series, you know, I, I work so much, I don't have time to enjoy the toys that I buy. And now with the Hollywood on strike, you know, I'm finally getting to enjoy some of this stuff. Well, uh, without further ado, let's get into this. So on the box here, uh, it says scan QR code to view tutorial. I'll get into that later on. Uh, we can see all the, 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 the stats here at the bottom of the box that tells you more about the drone. Uh, 2.7K video. Uh, 2.4 miles fly range, 30 minutes flight time. I'm a little bit disappointed by that, but I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get an extra battery or do some research, research to see if there are any, like, uh, anything to extend the battery life out there. Y'all feel free to hit me in the comments, give me some recommendations, I'll take it. Uh, it's under, half. it's under 5.5 pounds. Uh, in-app editor and of course GPS on the other side I have a bunch of facts about this thing it's the Maverick mini quadcopter with remote controller it's essentially all the contents in the in the box extra charging base intelligent uh, flight battery which means that if the if the drone senses that it's about to uh, run out of battery it will come back to to the ground and land safely and not just fall out of the air so with that said let me get my trusty little knife here and I'm gonna I'm gonna cut this thing I'm gonna cut this thing but this is like my first really real drone of any quality and uh, you know support my channel man support your boy and uh, Hopefully I'll have a lot of money to buy new gadgets, you know what I mean? And open them up so y'all can see. So, as we can see, uh, we have the, uh, the battery pack. This is the Maverick Mini Intelligent Flight uh, Battery. You know, with it being like the Hollywood Strike, this year I'm not gonna, like, especially when you get into the holiday season, I'm not gonna have any cash to go to go look in Costco and see if there's like, you know, like a newer version. This one is uh, a little old by now, like I said, I've had it for two years, sitting in my closet just getting around to open it. So it's the uh, Ultralight 249G, and you can see uh, it's folded down in that photograph. You can see uh, the remote with the slot for your cell phone, and then this is uh, 
the charging base, you know, which I just love. I, I uh, coming from a design standpoint, I love this design. It's sleek, it's compact, it's almost like it's a showpiece, you know. So uh, first things first, which one should I open first? All right, I'm gonna open the drone itself. So here it goes. Here it goes. Uh, I'm gonna sl slit this plastic and get it off. Get it off of there. Yeah, man, support your boy's channel so I can uh, unbox a bunch more of these. And any manufacturers out there uh, looking to support a humble designer, man, just holler at your boy, send me some product. You know what I mean? You heard? All right, what's the best way to open this? What is the best way to open this thing? Ah, here we go. Right here. There's a little tape. A little tape. Let's get this thing open. Oh, look at this. Ooh, that feels so good in my hand. That feels really good. That feels really good. I mean, I just... It feels sleek. It feels like, you know, like something well designed. I just love the, the design of the front. If you ever watch that uh, series, uh, Battlestar Galactica, it almost looks like the the front of some of the spaceships in those. You can see the camera. I can see the camera in there. That's really dope. And of course, you have like uh, the safety, uh, the safety uh, tape uh, all around to keep everything nice and compact. And then. Here is the remote controller. I'm gonna just get the plastic off. Oh man, this is nice. Uh, I've had drones before, but they've been like little cheap drones. And I, uh, my thought process behind that was, one, I was always working so much when Hollywood was in strike, obviously. I didn't have time to enjoy it, so I bought little cheap drones that I could fly. You know, of course, they didn't have all the features this ha this one has. So if I, you know, bumped them into trees or whatever, I wouldn't care. But this looks so sleek, man. They, uh, the remote feels so good in my hands. And this is how you extend it to put your phone in. I'm not going to do this immediately on this video, but I will get into it later. And these are the antennas. Yeah, these are the antennas. Let me see how it looks. Yeah. So, it will be oriented in this direction. Phone on this side, just like it, it says on the box, like it shows. So, the phone will be down here. This will be up. Your antennas, my controllers. I'm looking forward into actually uh, taking flight with this thing. And uh, as part of my kit, I'm going to figure out how to how to uh, make this a part of my kit. I have these uh, cases and foam. I'll customize a case to, to put this stuff in, you know, that I can easily uh, transport with me. All right, so that's the drone itself. Uh, should I go ahead and take these off? I'm going to go ahead and take these off before, before I, I open the, the, the charging case. Ooh. This didn't come off cleanly. Come on, kid. You got to get that off cleanly, son. That's what's up. All right. I'm going to uh, I'm going to remove the ones from the propellers. Going to remove the ones from the propellers. All right. Let's gently remove those. I don't want to be too aggressive here and break this thing. So, I'm going to Gently remove those so those get folded out. Uh, the question is, should I go ahead and fold this thing out? Yeah, let's go ahead and, and, and fold it out. So uh, the, 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 the ones on the bottom fold straight out. Then the ones on the front will... Oh boy, I think, oh, I, think I, I need to reverse this, sorry. So I'll, I'll reverse this. So. First things first, I'll fold out the ones in the front because you've got this piece right here that will prevent the one in the front folded. Uh, if you fold the ones in the back first, you ha you'll have this that will prevent the front ones from folding out. So first, I'm going to fold those out, right? And then I'm going to fold these straight back, straight back. There you go. 
and then that's uh, that's kind of the landing position of this thing. Uh, these actors, uh, like uh, I'm not even sure of the technical words, but it's, it's like the the landing the landing pads for those two front propellers. The bottom has these uh, has these two uh, sort of bracket like uh, structures here that will facilitate a good landing. And as you can see, that will facilitate a good landing. And then I'm also going to remove the, the, the sticker from the battery compartment here. Come on, dude, you can do this. <laughs> this thing's not playing fair. So I'm going to just uh, remove this. Uh, oh, that one was on there. Good. So then uh, my battery will be in here. All right. Wait a second. So uh, do I actually have two? Oh, it seems like I have two batteries in this bundle. So that's awesome. There's one already inside, and then there's one in the box. So this is great. This is great. I'll have an extra battery uh, for when I uh, take this uh, my brand new toy outside and have my first test flight. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, open up this charging case and see what's good. And uh, immediately I'm greeted with a little manual that will uh, show me how to use this thing. It's quick start. It's uh, it's like a pictorial, you know, it's a pictogram. So me being a, a designer and a visual person, I, I like these kind of manuals where it's just easy. I, I, I can just look at it and figure out how to do it. You know what I'm saying? So uh, first thing I'm greeted with is that. And then let me get this thing out. Ooh, fancy. So the power cord is in the is in this thing. I'll go ahead and uh, get it out. Let me go ahead and get this out. Like this, like all the like like these boxes that these different components, like the drone itself, the battery, the charging case. I'm gonna keep those boxes. And uh, like I said, I, I have like a like a case. It's not a Pelican case really, but it's a it's in the style of a Pelican case that I'll neatly figure out how to fit these boxes in there as a part of my kit so you know i'm just carrying one case instead of carrying like two or three individual boxes the bigger exterior box i'm gonna cut the piece that has the qr code on it and uh sort of keep that handy in just a pocket in my in my case and uh yeah the rest i'll just and then i'll recycle i'll recycle this box so let me go ahead and get this out as i'm going to call this it's my my showpiece my museum my museum piece <laughs> my museum piece yeah yeah i just i just love the design of this man just coming from a design standpoint like this is so sleek like when i'm at work when hollywood is off strike again i could actually just have this on my desk have my drone charging you know, and be ready to go if I've got to go out and take a survey, if I've got to uh, go look at a rooftop, you know, I can uh, have my drone fly around, you know, or even if I'm on the ground and I want to see uh, what's over a wall or whatever when I'm doing surveys in the field uh, for, my, uh, for my profession. But yeah, this is great. Uh, last thing I will open up, uh, last thing I'll open up, I'm just going to put this plastic in here. So I'll always have it. Last thing I will open up is this uh, extra battery right here. So let me see. How do I open this thing? Yeah. There we go. Ooh. What's the best way to open this thing without a lot of chaos? Yeah, I'm gonna just cut it, fam. <laughs> That's what I do a lot of times when I'm opening things. I just cut that. I just cut it, bro. All right, so here we go. Here's my extra, my extra battery, and uh, of course, there's the uh, instructions that go along with it. Yeah, so whenever I'm going out uh, for a flight, I will make sure both my batteries are charged before I leave the house and I'll go enjoy it. So that's me uh, unboxing my uh, 
Maverick mini bundle that I got at Costco uh, this year with the strike. I won't have any disposable income to purchase another drone, but in the near future, hopefully the strike will be over and I'll be working again. Uh, hopefully I can buy a bigger drone, a more sophisticated drone, you know, longer flight time, higher resolution camera, longer range, all that. But for now, I feel like this is a good starter drone for me uh, that's sophisticated, uh, has high quality video, and I'll be able to do a lot with this. You know, it's not always about the sophistication of your tools, it's how you use them. And I'm a master at making the most of uh, what I have. So, uh, uh, watch the end of this video. You will see me uh, going through the process of uh, my initial flights. And uh, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. Help me grow this channel. Help me get some sponsorship. Alright. Peace. Another feature of this bundle that I really wanted to highlight and I sort of repackaged the remote just to show you guys. Uh, another feature of this bundle is that in the, the case for the drone, under uh, the compartment for the remote, as you can see, under this compartment for the remote, what happens is there is uh, this box with the, with the little flap that you uh, take out uh, below that, you will have, you know, all the, the, the instructions and the, the quick start stuff. The quick start manual, again, pictorially, shows you how to, to unfold the blades. And, and this is the thing about me, again, being a designer, being very visual. Like, I could take up this drone and it made sense to me of how to unfold uh, the, 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 the legs with the propeller, the wings with the propellers, you know, so it just came sort of intuitively and natural to me. And here it is. I, I never even looked at the instructions, you know, but that's just kind of one of my intuitive qualities as a designer and, you know, learning how to make things and put things together. But what I really want to highlight is within this little box, when you open it, you're gonna have a, a power cord to charge the drone uh, by plugging directly into the back of the drone. So the, your power cord to plug directly into the drone is in this box. And then back to my, my show piece here, my glass case, which I love, that piece came with its own power cord. So if you're docking the drone, you know, on a desk in your office, at home, whatever, you'll have this power cord to that, and then you also have an additional power cord in the box of the drone that plugs directly into the back of the drone. And this is what I really want to highlight. In this box here, uh, you're going to find like extra, extra pieces for the drone, extra propeller pieces. If you have a, if you have a propeller that, uh, that breaks, you have the, 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 the actual blades in here, you have the actual tools, and uh, you'll have, and like I said, extra blades, extra blades to, to repair your drone. So that box is very uh, important, so if you get this box, you know, don't throw it out, make sure you go through it, make sure you have extra blades, uh, extra pivot piece, screw uh, pivot pieces to reattach those blades if you're your blades ever get damaged. Alright, so now on to uh, my initial flight. <laughs> 